Where I think the game is continuing to grow is it's no longer your D needs to be the fourth wave. A lot of times coming out of D zone coverage in today's game, your D is going to either have the puck, he may be the kickout player, he may be the third player down the dot line, he's pro probably not going to be the fourth guy in the play. So when you practice, again, thinking about how you build your practice plans, all right, how often do your D involved in three on two rushes? Because they're going to be involved in, in, in the game.